Ladies and gentlemen, so it's been a long time. You guys have been following the channel. You're here for the projectors. I understand that. There's a lot of models that I've reviewed this year that I didn't get to put on the list last year. I feel like you guys want to know what's out there, what's the best thing you can get your hands on. I just wanted to give you guys the top five portable smart projectors with 720p native resolution under $500 out right now. Let's go. Coming in at number 5, the AXA P700 Pro. With 650 lumens, a built-in Android operating system, and the ability to get up to a 150 inch image, this projector is a very nice choice. It has a very cool look and nice glowing buttons along the top of it when the lights are out. The contrast ratio on this one is 2001, giving it very nice dark darks and bright brights. This has many input options, HDMI in, memory card slot, you can connect to Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and the menu is very smooth and easy to navigate through. Streaming Netflix and other applications has really never been so simple. This is the time to get yourself a portable smart projector. Look at that. That is a 110 inch image and it looks beautiful. Coming in at number 4, the ZTE S Pro 2. This little guy is stylish as ever with a nice touch screen right on the surface making the menu navigation super simple. This projector can get up to a 120 inch image, it has 200 lumens and a 4000 to 1 contrast ratio. The S Pro is running an Android operating system 4.4 so again you can connect to Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and download applications, stream movies and this model also has regular HDMI and USB inputs as well so if you wanted to play a gaming system or Blu-rays that would not be an issue. Very cool with the little touch screen on top you could just tap on the application you want and start playing. Coming in at number 3 Wowoto H8 now this mini smart projector can get up to 300 inches, stream video, Miracast, YouTube, Airplay, Netflix, and get this guys, out of 80 reviews on Amazon, only 1% was negative. The rest gave it 5 stars. This has 3000 lumens, 2000 to 1 contrast ratio, and it's running an Android 5.1 system. Now there's a lot of people that have been asking me what projector runs higher than a 4.4 Android, and this will be the one. Very clear picture, very easy to navigate menu, and you can't go wrong with this one. Coming in at number 2, the Taomei V3. Now this was my favorite projector in the beginning of the year. This one is great. It has 2000 lumens, 2000 to 1 contrast ratio. It can get up to 300 inches, has the built-in 3D Android 4.4 system, but my favorite thing about this projector was that it's so easy to navigate through the menu and you can customize the home screen. So you could put a picture of whatever you want on your home screen, starting up the menu. It just felt really, really cool. Now typically you would not be able to find this projector for less than $400, maybe $450 and there is a special deal going on right now on GearBest.com. I'll leave the link down below in the description so make sure you check that out. Coming in at number 1, the Optima Intelligo S1. This projector is neck and neck with Taomei V3 which is a very hard position to take in my opinion. I recently purchased this model and I have a full length review coming this week so make sure you stick around. This has 5000 to 1 contrast ratio, 500 lumens and this projector is insanely clear. The image can get up to 150 inches and the menu feels so smooth to navigate. Just like the Taomei V3, you can customize your home screen with different pictures and make it feel a little bit more like you. This is running on an Android system and fully capable of streaming Netflix, Hulu, playing games and other Android apps, but this is brand new to the market and it is going fast. Last time I checked there was only 9 left on Amazon, I'll leave the link down below you guys can check this out and make sure you stick around for the full length review on this one. Alright, there you guys have it. That is the top 5 portable smart projectors of 2017. We're only like halfway through the year, so there might be another updated video later on this year. If you're not part of the team and you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe right now so you can get all those updated videos when they come out. We got giveaways, discounts, promotion codes, all that good stuff included, and all you have to do is subscribe, which is completely free. You could win some stuff, save some money. It's kind of a no-brainer. Thank you guys for being with me. It's fun as always, and I plan on doing this as long as the sun comes 
comes up and the moon still shines. And I plan on doing this as long as OJ Simpson is still in jail. Any of you guys following that Mayweather and uh, McGregor? Who do you think's gonna win? Is, is McGregor gonna get just destroyed because he's not a boxer or does he have a chance? Leave your comments down below, I'm curious to know. Peace guys. So last year I made a top five list. So last year I made a top five. Fuck. So last, so last year I made a, so last year I made a top five portable smart project. I run this shit, they like go for us. Run for us, run for us, go for us. Damn. What's one more quote for us? I go zero to one and real quick, real quick. Whole squad on that real shit.